or ask relevant questions. But if you say things like, it'll never work, I can't do anything with that, but if you point out specific areas, say, what are you going to do about this? What are you going to do about that? Bring it up specifically. All right, so here goes on the Venus Project. I've lived through the last depression. There were 15 million people sleeping in every empty lot across America. And uh, there were still things in store windows, radios, washing machines, everything. They didn't have the money. The banks failed. They bought new houses. They bought cars. And when the banks failed, they couldn't pay them off. They couldn't get money. So they were kicked out. And every empty lot in America, there were millions of people sleeping. And of course, at that time, immediately, the government didn't have any relief programs. So Al Capone, the gangster, opened more soup kitchens than the federal government. Isn't that interesting? Right. Right. The government also promised war veterans World War I. 600 bucks when they got out of the army to start life anew. Well, of course, the government didn't have that money after the war. So thousands of veterans marched on Washington. They were sleeping again all around the Capitol. And uh, the government offered them IOUs, but you can't eat that. You can't pay your rent with that. So they marched and they said, we, we want the 600 bucks you promised us. And so the Senate and the House of Representatives didn't like all these veterans sleeping around Washington. So they said to Doug MacArthur, get them out of the hair. It looks bad. So they had tear gas thrown at the veterans. See, these are things that are not in your school books. Your school books are BS. Mm -hmm. And they're made to get people in line. So all your history books have all kinds of men in government all doing the right thing, always saying things nicely. Those are not real people. Real people make mistakes, they do foolish things. And so a history book is made to look good. And of course, if you educate people to think, you can't control them. So you're educated not to think in school. Your program to uphold existing institutions. What's the greatest country in the world? The good old USA. The real thing is great in what area? Where did we get this land? We took it by force and violence from people that were already 50 million of them, and we drove them into the desert regions. Then we took California and New Mexico by force. After we stole all the land we needed, we put up the sign, thou shalt not steal. Mm -hmm. Of course, England did the same thing. They say the sun never sets on England. Where do you think they got that land? They took it, and they went into other countries not to help them, but to exploit them. And this is the story of all countries. They are all corrupt.